Okay, so this is a tutorial uh, showing how to use Audition to record uh, basic audio uh, for podcasts for Sterling and Stone and all that sort of thing. Um, so you open up Audition and you do a new uh, multi-track. You can click uh, uh, here for a multi-track editor and it'll create a new session. Uh, this is just a podcast recording or whatever the hell you want to call it, doesn't matter. You hit browse and you choose you know, what folder you want it to be in. Um, I just have a temp folder on my desktop here. Um, you don't need to mess with templates, but you set the sample rate at 44100 and the bit depth at 16. Those are the standard um, formats uh, for podcasts, CDs, all that sort of thing. Master, I uh, set to mono. Okay. Uh, you don't need to worry about any track other than your first track. And you go, you want it to say default stereo input but you want to make sure that your default stereo input is what it's supposed to be. So you click on audio hardware, and then your default input should be your microphone. Mine shows up on my system as USB audio codec. Uh, your, depending on what microphone you have, it might be different. Uh, and then you click OK. And so then you hit record, R for record, and you'll see that my voice is showing up on the thing. And just to make sure it's actually coming from my microphone, uh, you know, I tap it there. And, um, and it's, uh, it's, it's the microphone. So then when you're ready to record, you can hit shift space or go down here and click the little record, uh, thing. So this is now recording my voice. And so let's say I wanted to start the show now. So welcome to the podcast. Okay, cool. Thanks. See you next time. And now I'm done with the recording and I hit space to stop it. Okay. So now there's your recording, right? But. There was that whole thing in the beginning that we didn't want, uh, where I was talking about the introduction. And then this is where the actual show begins, right? So let's say we want to edit this out. Uh, there's a couple tools you can use to do that really easily. Um, you can do uh, the razor tool and razor cut uh, right there. And then you can select this and delete it. Alternatively, uh, you can use the uh, time selection tool and you can select the amount of time that you want to get rid of and delete that. And then finally, you can just use uh, the slip tool right here uh, and you can, uh, let's trim the end off. And so that cuts it down to the exact um, thing, you know, the exact, uh, uh, the actual program that we've recorded. So once you've done that, once you've edited it, to, uh, edited it to what you want, you right click on it and you say convert to unique copy. So over here in your file manager, here's our original sound file and here is the unique copy we've created and that is edited. That has the beginning and the ends cut off. So if we right click on this and we say reveal in finder, uh, there it is. There is our corrected file and if we play it back, we'll hear that there's no intro and there's no outro. There's none of that extra stuff that we recorded. And there it is. That's your, that's your recorded um, podcast file. You name it whatever you want and you drop it, uh, drag it into Dropbox for Audra. Uh, there you go.